had the pleasure of knowing Erin since I was in 10th, she was in 11th grade, good old Clio High School. Uh, she took me under her wing as an underclassman on the cheer team. I looked up to her in more ways than she probably knows. I can speak for both Erin and I when I say when we gained each other's friendship, we also got a second family and a second home, and that's been amazing. Like a castaway, what we wanted, not what we thought we wanted, tossed in. We are gathered here today to celebrate Come one of life's greatest moments, to give recognition and worth to beauty and love, and to cherish the words which shall unite Robert and Aaron in marriage. Robert and Aaron, true marriage begins well before the wedding day, and the efforts of marriage continue well beyond the ceremony's end. A brief moment in time and the stroke of a pen are all that is required to create the legal bond of marriage, but it takes a lifetime of love, commitment, and compromise to make marriage durable and everlasting. This day, the day of your wedding, is about love. Love is not just a word, it is an action. Love isn't something you just say, it's something you do. Love shows through in everything you do for one another and with one another. Love shows through in how you treat each other in good times and in bad. Love is genuine, honest, and open, compassionate and kind, passionate and blind. Love doesn't know space or time, nor look through jealous eyes. Love bears all things, believes in all things, hopes all things, tell you guys how thankful I am for Robert. He makes the most perfect teammate for my best friend. He respects her and he makes her ridiculously happy. I've watched them support each other through life's ups and downs and I can't wait to continue to see your marriage and your crops grow stronger every year. 